guys so if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter you will probably know that I have spent the last week in Austria um, I went skiing with my family and um, yeah today I just wanted to show you what I got over there so I'm going to start out with the clothing that I got I went to New Yorker they had a sale there I love that store so I got a few items there on sale because I love sale as well First thing I got is this leather jacket that I absolutely love. It has these um, like buckles on the side. Um, it is burgundy, which you know I love. And um, yeah, it has a nice side zipper that you can kind of just flap open like that. 10 euros for this. It was originally 50. Um, yeah, marked down to 10, which is an awesome deal. Then I got this legging, and um, I actually <laughs> I had actually tried this out when it came out in the summer. It was in the autumn collection, um, but I didn't like it enough back then to pay full price for it. But now it was marked down to 5 euros, <laughs> so I took it. Um, it is brown, has these little faux leather panels on the side. And I think this is going to look so cute with my fox sweater from Primark. So yeah, love that. And the last thing I got at New Yorker is this sweater. It is black, knitted with um, little gold strings in the black. And this was also marked down to 5 euros. I'm not sure what the original price was because I took the tag off. This is such a comfortable sweater. Um, this is definitely going with my favorite sweaters. <laughs> Because I absolutely love this. It is cute and it is really comfortable. Perfect. Yeah. I did get some, well, beauty stuff. I, oh my god, guys. I finally got white contacts. Oh, yes. So, this October, you're in for a treat. I have no idea what I'm going to do yet. But I have white contacts. Those are always awesome. Um, so, yeah. I cannot wait to try these out. Um, I will be completely blind when wearing them because I won't be able to wear my regular like prescription contacts But I'm excited to see how that will work out. I also got a complimentary white colored hairspray Because as much as I like the flower trick it um, doesn't really last that long The flower will slowly dissolve into your hair and drop out Just fall out of your hair. So um, yeah, I got some hair color spray in white on the way home from Austria, we stopped by my grandparents and I got some early birthday presents because my birthday is on the 22nd this month. Um, so yeah, my grandma got me this little set of a shower gel and body wash, which smells so good. It smells like citrus, um, grapefruit and orange and it is just so good and it looks really cute. So I'm going to Put this in a nice place in my bathroom. Oh, it smells so good. My other grandma, <laughs> she got me these cute little candles for like a Valentine's theme. Um, they're gold and glittery. I love these. I have to find a nice place for them in my room somewhere. But uh, I have a new candle tray set up, so I might just pop some on there. So I love that. And uh, she also got me this lavender essential oil. Which is great. You guys know I love my lavender. I'm absolutely in love with the scents of lavender. And this one is really, really good. So I may actually put some drops of this on my pillow. Which will be so nice to fall asleep to the scent. Oh. <laughs> I also got, as a gift, I got this um, awesome candle. But like, when you burn it... It goes through two wigs and then like four wigs. It is amazing. Absolutely beautiful. It's a white one. So yeah, that's going on my candle tree as well. I absolutely love this. It's really awesome. So then I got a bunch of food. Of course, you guys know, um, when I go to Austria, I stock up on my cake on a tea. I actually, I think I did really well. I got one, two, three, four. Four boxes of tea and then a few loose ones. So, um, yeah, let's just jump right into it. I got this. Um, Kamin Taube, which is new, apparently. It says Noi. <laughs> so, yeah, this, oh my god. 
so good, so good. It is spicy. We already bought one uh, when we were over there and we just drank it throughout the week and oh my god. It is so good. I, I don't even know what the main like flavors are in this. You can kind of see, you know, what the flavor is going to be like. Oh my god, this is probably going to be one of my favorite teas for the coming months. Then I got, this is the only refill I bought actually this year, which I am really proud of myself. I only got a refill of the uh, Wintertaube because I just absolutely love that one. So um, yeah, I already have some of these, but I just got a refill because I do not want to live without Wintertaube tea. Then I got Wintertaube. <laughs> this uh, tastes like berries. I don't know if this is going to be good. I, I'm pretty sure it is going to be good. I've only had one take on a tea ever that wasn't good. So yeah, I'm not afraid of that. And I just love berries. I love berries and tea. So I got that one. I got the glue fix. Um, apparently you make this and then you add some red wine to it and it makes glue wine, which is awesome. So I cannot wait to try that out. I think somebody must have left a few boxes of tea so when they left, so I just took them because I'm not going to waste tea. So I have um, this majestic tea that's like a fruit and um, herbs blend. I'm not sure what's in there because I didn't take the box, but it is really good. I had some yesterday and it, it's it's fruity. It's nice. <laughs> this take on a green tea with Opuntia flavor? I have no idea what that is, but um, yeah, I'm gonna try it out and we'll see how I like it. it smells a bit funny. Not sure about this, but there's only two of those, so <laughs> that's okay. I have a few more things left. I actually got um, two boxes of these fruit bars. They are... Um, yeah, pretty much pure fruit bars. I got a box of this while I was over there to uh, snack on while skiing and I really liked it. And they were only one euro and um, it's way expensive over here. So I just got two boxes of little fruit bars with no added sugar, of course. Another bottle of stevia because, um, well, I didn't run out of my old one, which I just, I just tossed it because it was old. So yeah, I have a new bottle now and I'm going to keep this one in the fridge and hope it lasts a little bit longer. The last thing I got is a packet of um, almond. Well, it's not almond flour, it's actually just ground almond. But this was only 2 euros and like ground almond in the Netherlands, 6 euros at least, is ridiculously expensive. So, um, yeah, I'm not too picky about my almond flour, so I can definitely use this as almond flour. Um, like a really really cheap version so I just grabbed this and took it with me so now I can bake with almond flour Woo! so that is all um, pretty much everything I got while I was on my trip to Austria that's all that I have for you today um, yeah I want to thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon bye